Northwest Kansas ordered a county to issue marriage licenses to same-sex couples. This is a domino effect of this week's decision by the U.S. Supreme Court to not hear some cases. It is believed Arizona's same-sex marriage ban could also be affected here. Here's News 4 Tucson's Lauren Reimer, new at 6. The Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals recently struck down voter-approved same-sex marriage bans in Idaho and Nevada. Arizona could be next, as it also falls in the Ninth District. Well, I think it's another step in the right direction. Jeff First and his partner, Peter Brambley, are married, just not here in Arizona. This, this weekend will mark our anniversary. The couple traveled to California one year ago to be able to use the word husband. You know, knowing that our marriage isn't acknowledged in Arizona is, is quite an insult still. In 2008, 56% of Arizona voters agreed to change the wording of our state constitution, defining marriage as only a union of one man and one woman. Judges should not be allowed to overturn the definition of marriage as defined by the voters. And they also have made their attempt to change the timeless institution of marriage. There are now essentially 30 states that do allow same-sex couples to wed. Whenever those dominoes fall, it's, it's good news for us. They hope Arizona may soon be added to that list. And so we're looking forward to uh, gaining the thousand or so rights that heterosexual marriages um, get. The Tucson couple is also part of a federal lawsuit challenging Arizona's ban on same-sex marriage, which could help move the issue along. Lauren Reimer, News for Tucson.